Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are getting back into Avatar The Last Airbender, book two. Before we hop on into Avatar, let's have a word from today's sponsor, Omaze. Omaze gives away one-of-a-kind prizes and experiences while donating money to charities from all across the world. Their sustainable approach to fundraising means that nonprofit organizations can spend less money and time raising funds and more time serving the needs of their communities. Right now, you can enter for your chance to win this amazing Mercedes-Benz Sprinter van, complete with an eco-friendly conversion. I have definitely spent a lot of time fantasizing about living that van lifestyle because I love camping and I love traveling. So this giveaway sounds pretty incredible to me. To add to this amazing prize, Van Smith will give your Sprinter an $80,000 conversion so you can enjoy a fully converted interior as well as your choice of exterior upgrades like a bike rack or all-terrain tires for those off-road adventures. This Sprinter is also designed with sustainability in mind. It comes with rooftop solar panels to power your gear, all natural build materials, and even a carbon offset package to fund environmental repair programs. And what's even better, if you're able to give, your donation can actually help the MicroWorks Foundation. MicroWorks is on a mission to help close the skills gap by challenging the stigmas and stereotypes that discourage people from pursuing millions of available jobs. They're redefining the definition of a good education and a good job because like a lot of us nowadays, they don't believe that the four-year degree is the best path for most people. Every donation will help support the Work Ethics Scholarship Program, which awards future tradespeople who will work smart and hard. For your chance to win a Sprinter van and to support the MicroWorks Foundation, just head on over to omaze.com slash nataliegold. Thanks so much again to Omaze for sponsoring this video, and thank you guys as always for listening to the sponsor. Now let's get back on into the show. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here and welcome if you're new. Today we are diving back into more Avatar The Last Airbender season two. I've definitely been enjoying this show a lot so far and we're already like halfway through the whole thing, which is pretty crazy. It's definitely been flying by. I've become so much more attached to these characters just in a season and a half. So much more invested. I think that's definitely a testament to the writing and the way that the writers have raised the stakes progressively with each episode. In this season alone, we've seen characters like Uncle Iroh get injured, Appa be captured and that not be resolved within an episode. We've seen characters like Zuko go through some really dark, sad, tough places. And I think it just all lends to a raising of the stakes, which makes me in turn more emotionally invested because... I worry more that something can actually happen to these characters and these creatures that I've slowly begun to love, especially because I love animals, so I really love Appa, but also because all these characters heavily depend on somebody like Appa. Like, he really is the MVP, so it's tough to see things not go well for those characters, but I, it makes me appreciate the way that this story is crafted because I think it's more compelling to watch a show where there are high stakes as opposed to just knowing and trusting that everything will be all right. We've had some new characters get introduced in this season, like Azula and her two sidekicks that I still can't remember their names. Toph, who is an incredible earthbender. Just a lot of really cool new people coming in to this show and I'm excited to see how it progresses, but I don't really have too much to say. I'm just excited to hop on into it. But real quick before we do hop into the show, I just want to mention that I do have a Patreon page. I always link it in the description bar below for those of y'all that are curious and want to catch my full length reactions to all of these Avatar episodes. I do post those reactions a fair bit earlier over there on Patreon. So if you like having the early content and watching these episodes along with me, I would definitely make sure to go check out my Patreon. And when I'm done with this series, I will be doing another poll over there to decide what we watch next show wise. So you definitely don't want to miss that. But with all that being said, I think I'm ready to hop on into this one. So if you guys are ready, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into the series. The sandbender snuck up on me and there wasn't time for- You just didn't care! You never liked Appa, you wanted him gone! That's so not true, Aang. You know Toph did all she could. Yeah, yeah, thank you Katara for sticking up for Toph. I'm going after Appa. Aang. Oh, Aang. Look! A cactus. Sokka, wait! You shouldn't be eating strange plants! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, Momo. There's water trapped inside these! I don't know. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Momo. Momo and him. Oh, are they on an acid trip? It'll quench ya. Nothing's quench here. It's the quench! 
Oh no, him and Momo are gonna be tripping. Momo, oh no! Can I get some of that cactus? I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, Katara has enough people to babysit now. <laughs> Abba! I, I like feel, I feel so conflicted that Aang went off on his own to do this. Cause like, I feel bad that he left everyone, but also I completely get it. Like Appa's his best friend. You're gonna find him, man. It's gonna happen. It's a giant mushroom. Maybe it's friendly. Oh no. Friendly mushroom. Mushy giant friend. Oh my God. <sighs> we're getting out of this desert and we're gonna do it together. Aang, get up. Yeah, you tell him, Katara. We have to. Yep, you do. Oh. <laughs> At least Momo and, <laughs> and Sokka are having a good time. <laughs> and what idiot buried a boat in the middle of the desert? A boat? Are the sand people underneath? I'm sure they're underneath the sand. Yeah, there you go. Airbending works. Yeah. That giant rock. It must be the magnetic center of the desert. A rock? Yes. Let's go. Yeah, a rock! <laughs> Maybe we can find some sandbenders. Yeah, Aang, you'll probably find Appa. As sad as, and as heartbreaking as it is to see like everybody's mainly Aang so upset, it like is kind of sweet in a way. Cause like you just see how devastated he is to lose his best friend. Like I'm happy Appa's getting appreciated, you know? If what they say is true, we must give them hospitality. Sorry, father. Does she recognize the voice? He's the one that stole Appa. I never forget a voice. Ooh, that's why he was getting so defensive. Ah! Ooh, uh-oh. Where is my bison? Aang escalated that very quickly, but I understand why. You said to put a muzzle on him. You muzzled Appa? Ooh, oh, this is, oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, Aang. Uh, Aang, you're breaking all the boats. You gotta leave the last boat. I didn't know it belonged to the Avatar. Ah, uh, there he is. He's telling the truth. I traded him to some merchants. How dare you? Please, we'll escort you out of the desert. We'll help however we can. You made him big mad. I don't know, son. Katara. Is Katara gonna try? She looks so sad. Aang. She's holding on to him. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna cry. He's crying. Oh, that's so sad. Oh my god! Oh no! <laughs> I want to find Appa. We're gonna find him. There's no way we can just like lose him like this permanently. You know, that would just be so crazy. But this is so sad. I'm tired of living like this, aren't we all? Yeah. Oh, Jet! I would have been more surprised had you not been in the recap. I kind of wish you hadn't been. I told you already! No vegetables on the ferry! Why? Oh, it's like customs. Oh, a, oh, the cabbage guy, no! Oh, my cabbages! Oh, this poor guy. You gotta get in a different line of work, man. It's not working for you. My name is Tao Beifong and I'll need four tickets. It is my pleasure to help anyone of the Beifong family. It is your pleasure. Look at this. But this document is so official. I guess it's worth four tickets. Yes, it is, ma'am. Wow, amazing. Is there a problem? Yeah, I got a problem with you. Is this Suki without makeup or something? Maybe you remember this. Hmm. It's Suki. It's Suki! <laughs> he remembered the kiss. Oh, she looks so different without the makeup. Are you doing okay? Oh, they're all looking at him. He's clearly not doing okay, but they're all worried about him. Our passports, our tickets, everything's gone. Why would they take that? You'll get to the city safely. I'll lead you through the Serpent's Pass. Oh, they're gonna, they're gonna go through the Serpent's Pass, I see. Sokka, I thought you'd want me to come. I do, it's just... Just what? Nothing. I'm glad you're coming. Is he feeling guilty? Is he feeling guilty because he likes... He misses Yue. You can't be with her, bro. It's okay. Yue would have wanted you to be happy. It says, abandon hope. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> that's all we have. Okay, ma'am, just, uh, couldn't we have told her and said something else? <laughs> they spotted us. Let's go, let's go. Oh no, you just made it obvious that you're the avatar. But also, I don't know what else you could have done, honestly. Sokka. Oh, thank God. 
You have to be more careful. Come oh, is he worried about her? You know, maybe that's it. He's probably worried about Suki because he's worried about losing another girl that he likes. He, oh, he's got not abandonment issues, but like kind of loss issues. You're perfectly capable of taking care of yourself. Wait! Oh, never mind. I thought I saw a spider, but you're fine. Suki, he's been through a lot, okay? <laughs> Oh, the moon. He's looking at the moon! Then why are you acting so overprotective? Because of the moon! <laughs> I lost someone I cared about. He didn't die. He just went away. I only had a few days to get to know him. <laughs> but he was smart and Aww. brave and funny. Who is this guy? He's talking about you. I guess he's not smart. Okay, maybe just funny. It is you, stupid. Yeah, he's not smart. You gotta take that descriptor back. What? He can't? Oh, he misses UA so much? That makes sense. I, you know, I get it. You're going to have to move on eventually, but it, it, it has barely been a season. <laughs> I've done some things in my past that I'm not proud of, but that's why I'm going to Bossing Say. Really? You're going to be try a... You, what words? You're going to try to be a better person, Jet? I believe people can change their lives if they want to. I believe in second chances. Oh, he's saying that to Zuko. Uh-oh. Oh, I don't know. Why did we zoom in on Jet with ominous music there? What is Jet planning? I don't trust him still. Uh-oh. Everyone single file. Yes. Yes! Oh, I just love how powerful she's become. She's Moses! She's parting the damn sea. Nice. That's pretty scary. I'm not going to lie. Wow. Oh, I wish Toph could see this. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a fish. Oh, it's a boat. A fish. A boat. Something. Ooh, nice job, Toph. Honestly, Toph really should have just earthbended. That probably would have made more sense. Probably would have been faster. The f Oh, great and powerful sea serpent. Please accept this humble and tasty offering. What? That's so f***ed up. Oh my God, she's such a baddie. I love it. She really is a master. She's surfing on ice. This is amazing. Oh no. I can't swim. Oh no. Suki. Is Suki going to save her? Oh, Sokka. You saved me. Uh, it's not Sokka. Oh my God. Actually, it's me. <laughs> you can go ahead and let me drown now. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so f***ing adorable. <laughs> that is the cutest sh ever, man. Suki just be getting kissed all the time. Oh no. She's gonna give birth, huh? The baby's coming. Yep. Now? Can't you hold it in or something? That's not how it works, you dummy. Oh. It's the first time she smi or he smiled. He's crying. I thought I was trying to be strong. But really, I was just running away from my feelings. He's growing up so much! It's reminded me how I feel about Appa and how I feel about you. <gasps> oh, I'm gonna cry! Gosh dang it! Oh. But now I need to get back to the other Kyoshi Ward. She's gonna go back through the serpent's past? Are you gonna swim? I just got carried away and before I knew- He's gonna kiss her? Oh. You talk too much. Oh. Oh. I'm nervous for him to look over the ledge. Uh-oh. What is it? Oh, is that the thing the Fire Nation was working on? Of course it is. That's just a gigantic pulverizer for the wall. Sorry, Momo. Appa's gonna have to wait. Yeah, Appa is gonna have to wait. Oh, no. Man! May and Ty Lee, take the Earthbenders out. Finally, something to do. How is she always bored? She's so crazy. She always bored. I have the situation under control. Oh no, he's one of those guys. This guy's naive. To stop it, I've sent an elite platoon of earthbenders. They're gonna be incapacitated very fast by these two girls. She's so nimble, it's not even fair. Uh-oh. <laughs> Who taught this girl, like, boxing acupuncture? We're doomed. Yep, there you go. Maybe you'd like the Avatar's help now? Yes, please. Yes, please. <laughs> uh. It's like she takes you down from the inside. Oh, 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 oh. Yes. We got to take the drill down from the inside? Yeah. We'll take it down from the inside. Gosh, when are we going to find Appa again? I just want to find Appa. 
But it's good that we're missing him for this long, you know? You want to join the Freedom Fighters? Thanks. But I don't think you want me in your gang. Think of all the good we could do for these refugees. I said no. Oh, God, what's he gonna do? Jesus. Jet is so... What are you doing firebending your tea? Oh, he saw the firebending. Oh, he saw it. Oh, that's what Jet was making a face at. Yeah, you shouldn't have done that, Uncle. That was really stupid. Oh, Jet saw that. Okay, that's what his face was about. It is the Avatar. And friends. She, why does she like Sokka so much? That's so weird. He likes her too? What the f***, man? <laughs> I mean, she is really cute, but like, what the f***? <laughs> Maybe we can be friends after this. Follow them. The Avatar's mine. Of course. Yep. Mm hmm Yep. Makes sense. She can shoot all the lightning she wants at me. I am not going in that wall sludge juice. <sighs> oh, she is. All right. She crazy. Oh, they're getting shot out the back. It's like excrement. I see. All right. That's good. Well, it's water. She can bend it. <laughs> nice. Nice. Talk. Help me plug up this drain. Nice. This is awesome. There's rocks and water. We can all work together. Incredible. Ooh. Nice. Nice. He's bending earth. Amazing. Nice. This is where earth bending really comes in handy. Momo. Momo. I love him. Look at this duo. So cute. He's so good at earth bending now. Look at him. He got so good at it, like, so fast. I guess it makes sense we're halfway through book two. But he really, like, learned earth bending faster than it took him to, like, to even start learning water bending. I feel like. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, good. Good. He was too fast for you, honey. Nice job, guys. I'm sure a lot of people are drowning in sludge in there. Yay. Oh, Momo, don't lick it. <laughs> We lost. <laughs> At least you're not covered in sludge. Back in the city. Great. <laughs> Why does she not like it here? Just a bunch of walls and rules. Oh, you can't earthbend here? Can you not earthbend here? I bet they don't want people earthbending like to disrupt the way the city was built. Who's that? Okay, she looks a little creepy. My name is Judy. Why does she have creepy music and that big smile? You're in Ba Sing Se now. Everyone is safe here. What is happening? Are they under like, it's like a propaganda city or something? And who are the mean looking guys in robes? She's not gonna answer your questions, bro. Those men are agents of the Dai Li. Oh, she will an answer. They are the guardians of all our traditions. Can we see the king now? Oh no, one doesn't just pop in on the Earth King. What if one is the avatar, ma'am? He's literally the avatar. Your request for an audience with the Earth King is being processed. Being processed, great. Through in about a month. Oh my god. It's about the war. Oh god, the city's- oh no. Oh no. Don't worry, we'll see him sooner than that, I'm sure, but jeez. I'll be happy to escort you anywhere you'd like to go. Oh god, we gotta ditch her. We gotta ditch her now. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Her creepy smile is f it. I hate it. It's disturbing me. Come on, you know. Uh... Oh, oh, it's because they have her. Oh no, they really need to ditch her. They're not gonna get any answers with her around. It's a propaganda city. She's like the KGB. We'll get in the party and then find a way to let you in through the side gate. Oh, that's what they're doing. That's their plan because they're just not even gonna bother with these two. That's so funny. Momo, <laughs> cutie, such a cutie. These two men are firebenders. Oh, Jet, oh no. All they have to do is not firebend. <laughs> I saw the old man eating his tea. He works in a tea shop. Yeah. Jet, you're looking a little crazy, even though you're right. Just don't use fire, Zuko. I don't think he will, though. Although, I feel bad for the owner of this tea shop. I'm sorry to bother you, but my cousin lost our invitations. She's blind. <laughs> I am honored. Oh, wow. What a nice man. What a nice man. Great. By the way, I'm Long Feng. I'm a cultural minister to the king. Oh, great. As your escort, it would be dishonorable to abandon you ladies without finding your family first. Ugh, these people in this goddamn city. Ugh, enough with the hosting. Back to the fight. Uh-oh. 
Was that a blue flame that just came out of the end of the swords? Zuko, you should stop fighting right now. I'm really concerned, man. I'm really concerned for you, bro. You don't know what you're doing. You actually don't know what you're doing. We saw the whole thing. This crazy kid attacked the finest tea maker in the city. Wow. Oh, that's very sweet. <laughs> Oh, wait, maybe he wasn't bending blue flames because Jet just had blue sparking off of his. Oh, OK, maybe it wasn't that. Maybe I was getting worried for no reason. I do feel bad for Jet, but like y you got to let it go, man. I do feel bad for him, but he got he got himself into this mess because he's right. But he's just a little too focused on stopping firebenders, I think. Uh Oh, what's happening? What is happening? Ah! They can bend their gloves? Avatar, it is a great honor to meet you. The cultural guy. Your friends will be waiting for us in the library. Uh-oh. Yeah, why are you guys so uh, determined to keep the war hush-hush here? There's no time to get involved with political squabbles and the day-to-day -day minutia of military activities. What? Really? So he's not involved in the war? So the king is just a figurehead. Mm, that's kind of common. You could lead an invasion. Enough. I don't want to hear your ridiculous plan. It is the strict policy of Ba Sing Se that the war not be mentioned within the wall. No wonder you guys are losing. That's why Jet's being thrown away. Calm down. You're safe now. Oh no. Oh God, they're brainwashing him. There's no war in Ba Sing Se. This is so creepy. Oh my God, they're trying to like hypnotize him into like silence. Oh no. I feel so bad for Jet. They have to know. I'll tell them. Uh-oh. Aang, you really shouldn't show all your cards like this. You guys are going to be held hostage. I understand you've been looking for your bison. Uh-huh. It would be quite a shame if you were not able to complete your quest. Ugh. Yeah, Aang, you got to be smarter. This is really horrible, though. Come with me, please. What happened to Judy? Uh-oh. I'm Judy. No, you're not. Judy was killed. Oh, my God. Never has an episode felt so, um, <laughs> poignant. The tale of Toph and Katara. Oh, these are all going to be different tales, I see. You've got a little dirt on your... Everywhere, actually. <laughs> you call it dirt. I call it a healthy coating of earth. Yeah, she doesn't care, you know? A girl's day out. Oh, I'm sure she'd love that. Her hair hasn't looked that crazy this whole time. What is it just like some extreme bedhead there? Sure, Katara. <laughs> Katara's all excited. Toph is such a tomboy. Oh yeah, she's not gonna want a pedicure where they shave all the calluses off. Oh, they're holding her down. That's funny. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, oh, she's got makeup on. I'm not usually into that stuff, but I actually feel girly. Aw. It makes sense that she wouldn't be into that stuff because she can't really even see how she looks. Like, you wouldn't really be into superficial, like, looking cute with makeup and stuff, you know? For a clown. <laughs> oh, those girls are just mean. Like that time we put a sweater on your pet poodle monkey. <laughs> how about you guys just beat their asses, okay? <laughs> you know what else is a good one? <laughs> now that was funny. Bye-bye. <laughs> I feel like you guys are gonna get in trouble for doing that, but I, I approve. I'm not looking for anyone's approval. I know who I am. Oh, she's still crying. You're so strong and confident and self-assured. No, she's not. She's having a moment of insecurity. You're really pretty. I am? Yeah, you are. Aww, Katara. I'd That's so the nice. But I have no idea what you look <laughs> yeah, like. Yeah, exactly. It would probably, it would just sound like a lie coming from her. <laughs> oh, that was so cute. Oh, the tale of Iroh. Oh, these are all going to be like little short, little super short stories. That's so cute. But it is a special occasion. Oh, what's the special occasion, Iroh? <laughs> is he playing an instrument for them now? Oh, you guys told me just wait till she hears Iroh sing Leaves from the Vine. Comes marching home. Huge! I feel bad for Iroh since he lost his son, you know? It's like really sad. You, give me all your money. Oh, come on. What are you doing? I'm mugging you. With your feet facing like that, yeah. With that stance? He's trying to fix his stance. You are unbalanced and you can be easily knocked over. He's even teaching this guy, oh my God. With a solid stance, you are a much more serious threat. But also maybe you shouldn't rob people. Much better. Ah, aww. You really think I could be a good masseur? Oh, 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 oh. 
little help from others can be a great blessing. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, Iris Day is great. This is the most adorable thing ever. He's gonna go watch the sunset under this tree with a picnic. He's having a picnic here. Wait, is this where his son is buried? Why do I feel like? Because Ba Sing Se was where he lost his son, right? Happy birthday, my son. Oh. If only I could have helped you. Leave from the vine. Oh, I get it now. I get. Oh no. It was a song he would sing to his son. Oh, that's really sad. Dang it. <laughs> the first time I heard it, I was like, ah, sure. <laughs> it's the second time. <laughs> oh, this is so sad. I wonder if, like, he's the person he is, like, now because... Oh, in honor of Mac... Is, is, that, is that the name of the actor who passed away? Ugh. It's very sad. One of the customers is on to us. Why? Don't look now, but there is a girl over there at the corner table. Why do you think that? Because she keeps looking at you? She just probably likes you. Thank you, and, well, I was wondering if you would like to go out. <gasps> look at how forward she is asking him. Oh, Uncle Iroh. <laughs> Poor Zuko, he's never had a chance to, like, be a kid or, like, oh, ew. Oh, no, not the hair. Oh, Zuko. Oh, God, no. Ah, ugh. Look at you. Uh-huh. Cute. Yeah, mess it up. Thank you. You fixed it. Great. It looks better now. She fixed it. <laughs> you have quite an appetite for a girl. Oh, he's so awkward. <laughs> you know, it's fitting that he would have a really awkward date. Hey, I want to show you one of my favorite places in the city. She's so nice, despite how weird he's been on this date. <laughs> the firelight fountain. Oh, no, are the lights off? Oh. Close your eyes. And don't peek. Is he gonna light them for her? I worry. You gotta hope that nobody is around. It's really sweet though. Isn't she gonna wonder what happened unless she's just stupid? That's really cute though. What the, you? Aww. 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 I brought you something. Oh, it's a coupon Zuko. for a free cup of tea. Zuko. Now it's your turn to close your eyes. Oh. Aww. Aww. Okay, he didn't, oh. Nope. What's wrong? Oh, just kidding. It's wow. complicated. I have to go. He probably feel. Oh, I feel really bad for her. But also, like, she really has a. She really has just been so forgiving of him for being so weird and awkward. But he probably just can't let his walls down. You know, he feels unsafe. Can't be vulnerable. How was your night, Prince Zuko? Oh. It was nice. Oh, it was nice, but you probably scared her away by running away and telling her it was complicated. But I'm happy for you. Momo! Momo gets a tail too, hell yes! Oh, is Momo dreaming about Appa? Oh. A storm, oh, oh, Momo. What is that? Oh, Appa's fur, is he gonna track Appa? No way. In the storm? Oh, yeah, it was just a cloud, Momo. Oh, he's looking for his friend, Momo. Oh, I'm getting more emotional over this. Uh-oh, uh, uh-oh. Uh why, why are there like lions in this alleyway? They're like lions, what the hell? They're huge. There you go. Uh-oh, Momo, oh God. Oh God, get higher. Oh no, it's they're dragging him down, Momo. Wait, but wait, let Momo go The Oh God, dang it, no. What? Momo, you can just unlock yourself, right? Momo better get back home after this day. What? They're trying to cook him? What the f Yeah, there you go. Unlock yourself, yeah. Is he gonna help the cats? He's gonna help the cats, isn't he? Help the cats! Do it! Look how sad they look. They don't have thumbs. Yeah, do it, Momo. Yeah! Good job, guys. Yay! Aww! Aww! <laughs> Aww! Wait, no! What? Are they- Oh, do they know where Appa is? Holy sh this is gonna have been the best story of all time. Yes, the footprint. Oh my God. Oh, but he's not around, huh? Oh, the rain. Oh, Momo. Oh, that story was really sad. Oh my God. Although not too sad because I'm pretty certain that we're gonna find out in the next episode given the title of it. Yes, wow, they, he's been missing a month. All right, you've got a deal. You guys don't know what the f you're doing. You are taking the wrong bison. Oh, they ride beetles. That's fun. We could sell him for parts. Sell him for parts? What What the f 
What, are you gonna, like, kill him and chop him up? Or sell him to buy parts? Is this a circus? Did he get bought into a circus? You had no choice but to behave outrageously. Oh god, is it a trainer? Fun. Because I am going to break you. Oh no. Oh no, I'm gonna- oh no. Oh no, this is sad. Oh no. Oh no, it's a circus. Oh, I'm sad. What, are we not- we're not feeding him? Don't worry, I'm going to feed you too. But not yet. Uh-huh, right. This guy's great. You know, torture your animals by not feeding them until they give you what you want and do what you want. <laughs> Good job, Appa. Oh, really? You're not gonna share with your son? What a jerk. Oh, why do we put makeup and on it? Why did we do that to him? What was the point? Run away! Get away from him! Yeah. Oh. Little kid. Oh, the little kid reminds him of Aang. Nice! Get out of there, Appa. Nice! Oh, he still has chains on, though. Poor Appa. Oh, is he going to look for... Oh, he was going... He went back into the desert. Holy sh**. Oh, what's he gonna do now? He's gotta end up in Ba Sing Se. This is crazy. Oh, he's dreaming of what life was like back where he, when he was a kid. Oh. Choose well. <gasps> a sky bison is a companion for life. Oh, they were good. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> this is like reminding me of when I chose Coda. <laughs> I guess this means we'll always be together. Oh, God. Oh, and he was dreaming about that, too. <laughs> oh, poor Abba. Can somebody just help him? I feel so bad for him. Can someone just take care of him? Oh, he's sitting here for days and nights. Oh, is she gonna find him? No f***ing way. Wait, let me see that. No way, Suki? Suki. That's her name, right? I actually can't remember her name. Suki? <gasps> Appa? Oh my god! Oh, he's seen some shit. He's so sad. He's so scared. Appa, <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Animal abuse makes me so sad. <laughs> Oh, good. Oh, okay. Good. Oh, God. It was so sad to see him all scared. Oh, God. Who's here? Oh, is it f Ah, it's her. God damn it. Oh, f She's always here to ruin the day. Fly away from here. Yeah, you should have done that a while ago. Oh, no. Suki. Suki, it's okay. Oh, no, Appa. No, you really need to get out of here. I know you want to help. Oh, Suki. Don't you know fans just make flames stronger? That's true. Is she, oh no, oh no! We're cutting away, is she gonna be okay? Oh no! Oh God. What, who is this? Hello, I am Guru Patik. Uh, he's just laying down. They're having a standoff now. It's still growling at him. <laughs> This is so funny. By reading your energy, I can sense where Aang is. Oh, really? Oh. Wow, it's really great that you stumbled upon this magical guru meditation man who just knows everything. I'll see you again, great beast. Yeah, I, yeah, their paths got across again because he's got to meet Aang, I'm sure. That's, ah! Oh. oh no. Oh no, who are these guys? Is he going to be captured again? I'm nervous he's going to get caught or something. Oh no, he's being called by these guys. I was gonna, uh oh, ah! It's the guy of the Dai Li. Oh no, oh no. Of course they're holding on to Appa so that Aang will behave. Oh, this city is so fucked up. Oh geez, oh God. Wait, she's back, it's the same girl. Oh, I simply took a short vacation to Lake Laogai. Lake Laogai, that's what it's called. You are absolutely forbidden by the rules of the city to continue putting up posters. Wow. We don't care about the rules and we're not asking permission. Yeah, yeah you tell her, Aang. It will, but I f***ing agree. I'm very disappointed in your work with the Avatar. It's not Judy's fault. Judy's trying. You just can't control the Avatar. The Earth King has invited you to Lake Laogai. What's Lake Laogai is- oh, 
Oh, is she being hypnotized? Is that like a like a cue for them to go into hypnosis? Oh my god. Oh god, they are so evil. They are like scarier than any of the firebenders that I've met, except for uh, Azula. I think I keep accidentally calling Azula's circus gymnastics friend Azula as well. I forget her name. Azula's the only firebender that scares me more than these Daily. The Daily are <gasps> creepy. Oh no. I think I can help you. Tora, I've changed. Ooh! Yeah, he's he's brainwashed now. I'm here to help you find Appa. Yeah, you're working for the Dai Li now, huh? Maybe not. He could just be brainwashed. I don't know. He's still probably not good to trust, unfortunately. We were so worried. How did you get away from the Dai Li? The Dai Li? Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't know he was brainwashed. Yeah, he doesn't remember any of it. They both think they're telling the truth. Jet's been brainwashed. Sokka, you smarty. Smarty pants, he knows. Okay, good. I'm glad they're figuring this out. Because Appa's totally here. They're, they're keeping him here, and they're just trying to get the Avatar out of the city, I think. Maybe he's in the same place they took Jet. Mm -hmm. Where do they take you? He doesn't know. It's like a hypnosis. He doesn't know. Oh, is she healing him? His brain? Oh, wow. She really is so powerful if she can do that. Oh, him. Lake Lao guy. Damn. Katara. Katara basically has the capabilities to heal all of the brainwashed people in this city. All of the Dai Li. That is amazing. What a baddie. I'm Judy. Welcome to Ba Sing Se. Oh, they're all Judy. Judy. Welcome to Ba Sing Se. Ah, this is so terrifying. Appa. Oh, f Oh, that was a really good editing transition. Dang it. That was good. Zuko, you gotta let this goal of trying to capture the Avatar go. Like, your dad is never gonna give you the throne. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Toph, yeah! Oh, she just breaks their gloves. Yeah, what are you gonna do without your gloves? Huh? I mean, I guess they probably are earthbenders. Or maybe, are they just glove benders? Can we unbrainwash them all? If Katara could just heal them all, that'd be pretty great. Oh, he's running. Uh-huh. Like a the Earth King has invited you. Uh oh. Lao guy. Wait, shouldn't this not work on him? Oh no. Oh, it still works. F I thought Katara healed him. Oh no. Iroh. Iroh followed him. What do you plan to do now that you have found the Avatar's bison? Right, good question. Stop it, Uncle. I have to do this. No, you don't. Who are you? And what do you want? Yeah, what do you want? He can't make you do this. You're a freedom fighter. You are a freedom fighter. Good job, Aang. <laughs> nice. Oh, no. Jet. Oh, Jet. No. Is he okay? No. Jet. There's no time. Just go. <gasps> he spoke. He's our leader. He spoke. I'll be fine. Oh my god, that was such a powerful choice. Wow. He's lying. Oh, is he gonna die? That's so sad. That's so sad, man. Oh my god. I mean, luckily there's a whole lake of water right there for Katara to bend. Is Appa nearby? Appa's totally nearby, huh? Yay! Yay! Ah, uh, Appa. I can handle you by myself. Oh, really? Uh-huh. Do you really thought you could, bro? Really? That's funny. Oh, Appa. I missed you, buddy. Oh, every time Aang cries. And Jet is just like presumably dead down there. That's so sad. Oh, I bet they set Appa free. You did the right thing, nephew. Yeah. Zuko, I'm so proud of you. What a growing moment. Oh. So sweet. He didn't even look. He just went boop. Good job, Aang. Holy <laughs> Wow, he's become so powerful at earthbending so fast. It's amazing. He really just picked it up so fast. He's going to have to spend a lot of time with firebending, isn't he? I bet that's going to be like a more mental block for him because of his fear with it. Oh my god, they look. Oh my god, look at these little badass kids. Look at them. They're such badasses. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry! <laughs> oh my god, they're such badasses. I love them. They've grown up so much. I mean, Toph was always a badass, but 
Oh my goodness, I love this. They're so powerful. This is so cool. I love it when they have like serious looks on their faces and are all angry and powerful and intense. I love it. Oh my God, look at them. They're not even communicating. They just are thinking the same thing. They're so in sync. But like, I worry that they're gonna get in to see the Earth King and, and the Earth King's just gonna be a puppet. Like he's not gonna know or care. Make sure the Avatar and his friends never see daylight again. The Avatar? It's the Avatar, yeah, exactly. Thank you, Earth King, yes. Part of me really hopes that what you're telling me about this war isn't true. Of course, of course you want that to not be true, of course, but like it doesn't, you can't just bury your head in the sand, bro. It's still there. Oh, good, thank God. A giant drill made by the Fire Nation to break through your walls. Yep. Good thing there's a gigantic fire logo emblem on it. <laughs> Dai Li, arrest Long Feng. Good job, King. Although I feel like they've been brainwashed to obey him, so I don't know if it'll happen. Yeah, they're not, they're not listening. Uh-huh. Oh wait, they are. Good. Oh, they are. Oh, they are arresting him. Wow. I really didn't think they were gonna get through to the king. I thought they were just gonna leave the city. Very well. You have my support. Oh, good. Yay. Great, wow. See, he's a good king. He just was dumb for a long time. She can't read it, so she just passed it on to Katara. Your mom's here in the city, and she wants to see you. Oh no. This scroll was attached to the horn of your bison. <gasps> right, from the guy. A small fleet of water tribe ships? Led by Hakoda, it is dad. Aww. I can't wait for them to meet up with their dad, guys. I'm gonna cry when it happens. Oh, are they all gonna try to go to different areas? Oh no. We have to split up. No, no, oh no. I know how badly you wanna help dad. You go to Chameleon Bay. I'll stay here with the king. Oh. Are the nicest <laughs> sister ever. Oh. Oh. A rare moment of kindness between the two siblings. There are three female warriors here to see you. <gasps> That's Suki! No! I got nervous that it was the three fire bender, you know, with Azula, the three girls. No, 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 what if it's them and they're dressed up in Kiyoshi attire? What if they stole outfits? I also think Toph is just gonna be kidnapped, whether it's her mom or not. They're just gonna try to take her home or, I don't know. <laughs> yep. It's not surprising at all. Like, I, I'm so shocked that they split up and they thought this was a good idea because I, I really think it's gonna go horribly for all of them. We are the Earth King's humble servants. Yep, not surprising at all. That's actually, that's so freaky, but like such a good choice in writing, honestly. It's juke. I'm sure you wouldn't like it. What, does he like it now? It smells delicious. I'd love a bull uncle. Is he completely different now from his metamorphosis? He's got less baggage, less issues. What if he, what if when he sees Azula, it all comes rushing back? <laughs> Things are looking up, uncle. <laughs> oh, uncle Iroh's happy, but I have a feeling it won't last. Maybe it will last, I don't know. Oh, his dad, his dad, his dad. Is that, oh, is he in there? Oh. Hi, dad. Oh, oh, no. The Kyoshi warriors are here to protect us. No, they're not. This king is such a dummy. Plan an invasion. No, duh! Now that sounds like a fascinating and brilliant plan. What the f I can't be this king is so f stupid. Why the f would you open up to even the Kyoshi warriors about this plan? You might think you're the greatest earthbender in the world, but even you can't bend metal. Do you think she can? She gonna try? <laughs> She's gonna try though. Thanks. Hey. Tell me everything you know about chakras. What are chakras? He doesn't know anything? How does he not know anything? There are seven chakras that go up the body. So the root. You know, there's like heart and throat and there's a spiritual one up here. I took yoga, okay? You cannot stop until all seven are open. What if he does stop and then it blocks him from like learning fire or something? Maybe that's why it was so easy to beat the Kiyoshi warriors and take their clothes. Oh, thank you for talking about this openly, guys. Do you want the whole palace to know we're Fire Nation? Oh, they one guy already heard. Good job. For once, I'm happy the Dai Li is here. They're such stealthy spies. Good work, girls. Oh. I'm sure the Dai Li will deliver the message. Oh, f they knew. God damn it. They're too smart. I hate these girls. I mean, I'm happy that they're powerful women in the show, but it's ugh. The air nomad's love for you has not left this world. It is still inside of your heart and is reborn Aww. in the form of new love. 
Appa and Sokka and Katara. Oh, just Katara. <laughs> okay. Aww. Oh, he's so cute. You will see that all the elements are one. Oh, metal. Oh, back to Toph. Even metal. And she's gonna bend it. Yeah, you can do it, Toph. It might be hard, but you can do it. She can do it. Yeah. Toph, you rule. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do, girl. Meditate on what attaches you to this world. Oh, Katara. That's <laughs> all Katara. What about Appa? Like, your friends don't count just because Katara? Oh, let her go. Oh. Why would I let go of Katara? Oh, he doesn't want to. I just saw Prince Zuko and his uncle. We have to tell the Earth King right away. Wow, this makeup is really fooling everybody. I'll be sure to let him know. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Ah! No. <laughs> Katara. No! Oh, no. Oh, he's hearing her because she's in trouble right now. Holy sh**. Katara's in danger. I have to go. No, Ang. What? If you leave now, you won't be able to go into the Avatar state at all. Oh, no. Aang. Oh, that's so bad. Hey. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's like when Luke leaves Jedi training too early, you know? Oh, no. This is so bad. <gasps> is it Appa? Oh, Aang's back. Oh, I'm sad he has to leave his dad. Oh, they're both looking back at each other. Oh, I'm getting so emotional in this episode. What do you want? Uh-huh. I want to make a deal. Of course they want to make a deal. I can't believe it. Uh-oh. Great news. No, it's not. It's a trap. We've been invited to serve tea to the Earth King. Yeah, there's a reason you were invited. Seizing power today is a matter of life and death. You're letting a Fire Nation girl tell you guys what to do. This is so stupid. Long Feng is just such an asshole and so stupid. Like you're willing to like let your entire tribe suffer just to like be in control again when in reality it won't matter when the Fire Nation defeats you. Did I ever tell you how I got the nickname, the Dragon of the West? I like how he's still gonna drink his tea. I'm not interested in a lengthy anecdote. I would be, your uncle's a very interesting man. Oh, is he gonna firebend with tea? Holy f Holy f That was impressive, Uncle! I like how Zuko knew and just ducked behind him and spun with him. That was so cute. I'm tired of running. It's time I face Azula. Zuko! Uh, Iroh's like, ah, oh, damn it. Zuko. She, she fights dirty, Zuko. Where is she being kept? You've got company. Oh my god! With Zuko! Oh boy. Oh, this is awkward. <laughs> Maybe you guys can work together. I've, I've really been wanting Zuko to like join the crew, honestly, for a long time and work with him. Cause I, I've always felt like he's a good guy and like should just give up on chasing the avatar. Actually, I know who it is. Uh oh, who is it? Really? Glad to see you're okay. Iroh. It's, this is great. This is great. Oh my God. Yeah, it's great. It's good guys, it's good. Yes, this is good, this is good. Iroh's a good guy. Oh, I love this. Then we'll work together to fight Azula. Great, great, this is exactly what we need, great. You're a terrible person, you know that? Always following us, hunting the Avatar. He, he actually doesn't care anymore. Katara, he actually let all that go, but I know you wouldn't know that. The Fire Nation took my mother away from me. Wow, she's really opening up to him. That's something <laughs> we have in common. Yeah, that's true, actually. You guys gonna bond? Oh my God. I've realized I'm free to determine my own destiny. Yeah, you are. Even if I'll never be free of my mark. Maybe you could be free of it. Could she heal it? <gasps> she gonna use the special water on him? She would save it for him? That is so f sweet, man. Oh my god. Oh, but we're gonna be interrupted right now. <laughs> it's time for you to choose good. Oh! Uh-oh. Oh no, Iroh. Oh god, it's them. Oh, right, because they're working with Dai Li. That's why they can bend the crystals. It's not too late for you, Zuko. Honey, what? Zuko, don't, don't do it. I need you, Zuko. No, she doesn't! And the only way we win is together. That's not true. She just wants you as prisoner so she can look good for your dad. You will have father's love. No, you won't. It's a manipulation tactic. Zuko, your uncle is the only one who's ever been there for you. Is it Zuko? Yes, Zuko! Wait, what's he doing? No, what's he doing? No. Zuko! Zuko. I thought you were smarter than this, man. He's... <sighs> I thought you had changed! 
Yeah, I thought so too. What the f I have changed. Huh? What do you mean, Zuko? Then why are you doing the same old thing? Katara, oh no. Oh no! Her hair is down. What the hell, Zuko? I am so disappointed in you right now. The only way is to let her go. Oh. I'm sorry, Katara. <laughs> he's gonna work on letting her go. What's gonna happen? Does that mean he's not gonna love her anymore or something? Th that's so sad. Does that mean he can never like love her? It's just so sad, man. Oh no. She's trying to kill him in the Avatar state, right? No! Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. Oh no. What's happening? Thank you, Iroh. I'll hold them off as long as I can. Oh, oh no. This is so sad. I'm so sad. Oh god. Oh god. I'm so disappointed in you, Zuko. Oh my god. What's happening? Is Aang can't die, but like, oh, he's she's gonna use the water. She's gonna heal him. I'm glad she didn't use it. Ugh. But like, is he gonna not remember her or not love her anymore because he let her go? I'm just so nervous. Okay, I think he remembers her. He was smiling. Today, you restored your own honor. Oh, Zuko. Zuko. It's all in the name of ego and pride. I mean, I guess it's like because of family baggage as well. And now they have the king with them. Like, <laughs> I don't know what they're going to do with him. Man, I was right about one thing. Uh, I did cry. So sad. <sighs> oh my God, only one season left. This has definitely become a show that I look forward to a lot each week, getting to watch this with you guys. And I'll be sad when it's over. I mean, we only have one season left. I, there's a part of me that really wishes that it was longer, but at the same time, I'm really happy that it's not too long because I feel like sometimes when shows drag on long, the story actually isn't as great as if it had been more concise. So the fact that it's so short and so much is happening in all these episodes really does lead me to believe that, you know, we're going to have a really great last season and a great powerful ending, but I am still sad that it's going by so quickly. I've really become so attached to so many of these characters in such a quick amount of time. I really feel invested in all of them at this point, even some of the more troubling characters like Zuko. I, oh, I'm so disappointed in the way he behaved in this last episode, but I feel like the story is only going to get more and more interesting and conflicting for him. I feel like the last season, I feel like if I had to guess, probably by the end, he'll do something that's really redeeming, even if that means like dying to protect the Avatar. I feel like he'll probably have some really powerful redemption arc. He's just such a troubled character and I do empathize with him a lot and I do understand why he's so conflicted. Like, I get why he wants to, you know, earn his father's love and be accepted by his family. It's a really hard thing to let go of something like that, especially because his ego is all tied up in him wanting to rule or at least be a part of the royal family. But it breaks my heart that he betrayed Iroh like that. I mean, you think after all of this time, after everything Iroh has done for him, that he wouldn't betray him. It's just so sad. I think it's also sad too uh, regarding Uncle Iroh because I think you guys have told me that the actor Mako, I hope I'm pronouncing his name right. I don't know if I am. Um, I heard that he passed away after season two. So that makes this especially sad because this was the last episode presumably that we'll have with him. It's always difficult when you lose an actor halfway through a series or um, during a filming process and they have to be replaced by someone else. It's always not quite right. So I'm interested to see what the next actor does with the role. But yeah, I've grown so attached to Uncle Iroh. So that is really sad. Man, these characters have just grown up so much and gone through so much in these last two seasons. Yeah, I just find myself getting so emotional and worked up with all of these characters now because I just empathize with all of them in different ways and seeing them go through these hard, heartbreaking moments. Sokka saying goodbye to his father, Aang having to let Katara go, Katara loving Aang and trying to help him and just all these moments I'm just so invested in now and I feel like it's gonna lead to me breaking down in season three. I'm really nervous to see what happens in that season, especially in the finale. I'm happy she was able to heal him, but yeah, I imagine that that's gonna leave him being, feeling blocked and probably scared of going in the Avatar state again, especially around someone like Azula who really takes advantage of that. <laughs> uh, if Katara didn't have that water, uh, this would be a lot sadder of an ending. 
I feel like the writing for this show has just been so well crafted. Like it's so clever and the way they execute every little bit in the plot is just so smart and leaves me getting really worked up, really invested as an audience member. Um, even little more subtle choices in the writing are so smart. Like a few episodes back where Jet got hurt and his friend, his member of his gang who never speaks finally spoke in that moment. It just made it so much more powerful to hear him speak because we'd never heard him speak before. The fact that that whole episode Toph was, you know, repeating, oh, this person's telling the truth, that person's telling the truth. And at the end, she just has that subtle line where it's like, he's he's lying. He's not telling the truth when he, Jet said he would be okay. Like certain little moments like that just really show how smart the writing is because just hits you in the heart that much harder when it's well-crafted. And uh, yeah, I've really become attached to these characters and I have a feeling that I'm gonna be an emotional wreck come this last season. I think I'll probably end up breaking up the last season into three videos because uh, these videos have gotten pretty long over here on my channel and it's kind of hard to cut a lot of stuff out. Um, there's already a lot that we're cutting out. So if you do feel like you're missing stuff, definitely make sure to go check out my Patreon page. I always link that in the description bar down below and um, I have a lot more moments that get missed over here on YouTube that are in my full length reactions over there and I also post those episode reactions a lot earlier so it's definitely a good place to go check out if you're a fan of Avatar and I'll be sad when this is all over but it just leaves more room to watch something new and to go on a different journey with you guys. I hope you've been enjoying Avatar with me so far. I've definitely been enjoying it a lot and I hope you guys liked this video. So if you did, definitely make sure to give it a thumbs up so that I know and I can make sure to watch more stuff like this in the future. Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and anything else you might like me to watch next and subscribe if you want to. Till the next one, stay golden. Bye.